So we found a huge discovery in Demon Slayer last week that I believe is probably the most important lore drop moment of the series. The way to defeat Muzan, Mitsubishi, paper airplanes, bumblebees, and, and pancakes. I thought it was gonna be some Demon Slayer slaying shit, but no. So today we have episode five of season four. Is this the is this the finale? I even ate demons, which I think it's gonna focus on Mitsidi, Miss Titty, the the Titty Hashira, and uh, maybe Obanai. Hopefully, I think I saw a picture of Obanai and Tanjiro, so that would be nice. And uh, yeah, let's 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 do this shit. <laughs> That's the ultimate weapon. <laughs> oh my god. I knew it. I knew this is how we'd be Muzan. The power of pancakes. I want you guys to answer this question down below. If you could only pick one, which would you pick? To be fed by Mitsuri or to cure cancer? Which one would it be? I know my answer. Which is sick because my, my dad has it. Sorry, Dad. A dress? We're gonna be moves on in a dress! We don't even have the episode. The episode reveal! The, uh, and then the episode title, I guess I guess not today. I guess we're um doing yoga with Mitsuri. Why isn't Mitsuri wearing that? More importantly, why isn't the bird wearing that? I'd like to see that. We're gonna beat Mu Muzan. We're dancing. This is gonna be step up. All right, so um, paper airplanes, bumblebees, pancakes, and dancing. <laughs> Something else is getting stretched out right now. Oh my god! Now that is how you're gonna beat Muzan right there. Holy shit! That would beat me. There's no no better sign of strength than to be able to Come do a split. Yes! Fuck yeah, here we go. Finally, someone new. I've been waiting for you. There we go. I've been waiting for him. <laughs> oh, really, did she? He's jealous. Oh, shit. <laughs> Jealous that Tanjiro got her pancakes. I wonder if uh, Igoro got pancakes. Oh, he's gonna bully him. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> wow, so he is in love with her. <laughs> I'm happy his family died. He's so adorable. Oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> Put him through hell! Yeah. <laughs> now this is my type of training course, bro. They thought, what's his name? Yuchiro was brutal, bro. Wait till they get here. <laughs> I fucking love this already, man. And the snake. <laughs> is this training for them or for him? Let's see. <laughs> You pull, oh my god, they're like, <laughs> Tanjiro, use your Tanjiro. That's all you gotta do. It doesn't look that hard. I think I can do that. Oh my god, here we go, bro. Omenai versus Tanjiro. <laughs> I swear I could play an NPC. A Demon Slayer live action is bound to happen, so this is my uh, audition. Whenever I, I reenact the NPC's cries, um, yeah, that's like my audition tape. Send it into the uh, Kimitsu no Yaba team. I love his teaching methods. I agree with him the most. This is the teacher go to. I keep thinking he says Boruto there. <laughs> oh my god. See, already I love this episode because we get to see Igoro. <laughs> what was that? Does his sword turn into a snake? What the fuck was that? That should turn into a snake! What, anything he, tur he holds can turn into a snake? 
This is both brutal and goofy. I love that shit. That's awesome. Y'all remember um, Inosuke and Zenitsu? Uh, I, I don't. They could fit in here. I want to see Zenitsu and Inosuke trading with Obenai, bro. That would have been great. <laughs> All right, if we're seeing this <laughs> many NPCs <laughs> lately, <laughs> I, I think they're going to play an important role in the battles to come. I wonder how they would... I'm cutting that sentence off. I'm saving it for another time. I, I think this is a bath. Oh. I thought we were in the mid-city chambers but um yeah the amount of times i've seen tanjiro's ass cheeks bro more than i want to <laughs> oh i can feel that from here man i love that we're seeing this guy this is the most dialogue he's had he's gonna start wouldn't they be bleeding together in that hot tub bro that's a little weird and contaminated Tanjiro has the bump on his head like the uh, um the uh, demon from last season. The <laughs> that one. What they put VR goggles on? What the fuck? This is awesome. Just straight up sword combat with him and Igudo, bro. But with this environment, it's so cool. The way Igudo moves, though, man, he's. Fucking fighter. He's like Randy Orton. I love I love him. I fucking love him. <laughs> Look at the snake. <laughs> Wait, that's it? No, 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 yeah! Oh my god, Chantaro, Chantaro! The day has come! I don't give a fuck about Zenitsu, bro! Where's my bird? Chantaro's gonna come and pull him away, isn't he? Oh, that's not fucking Chantaro! Who is that? Oh! Shit, it's Sonami. me! I used to call him Seaman. Oh my god! See, this is what I wanna see. I wanna see Sonami training with um Zenitsu. That would be awesome. <laughs> Probably the best episode so far, bro. Finally, shit. Why isn't Chantaro in the scene? I don't get it. <laughs> Him and Igudo fucking hate Tanjiro, bro. Damn, let it go. <laughs> That's true. <laughs> Getting the Igudo training and the Sonami training in the same episode. <laughs> What in the 80s is this? <laughs> so much hatred in these Hashira's hearts, man. It's crazy. I want to train with him. Who are we going to run into now? Genya? Oh, shit! A brother reunion, Genya and Shinaka Gawara Wawaza. I saw your flashback, bro. What are you talking about? Oh. Look how Genya is completely changed, bro. That's crazy. Like, it's rare we, we saw him like that, like, before um, the Swordsmith Village arc. So now to see the side of him, and then he looks at his brother like that, like the little brother. Like, we thought he was edgy. Uh-uh. -ah, bigger brother's like, fuck that. Wow. Look at him. He's, like, disgusted by him. Genya go into vampire mode by him. Wow. Bro, fuck Onicho. <laughs> My god. He's gonna stop walking. Oh, oh shit. Oh shit. Oh. <laughs> what did you just say? I ain't demons, bitch. Timmy. Oh my god. Let me know how he feels around demons. <laughs> Look at that, man! Is he gonna... What the fuck was he about to do? Was he about to poke his eyes out? <laughs> Where the fuck is Shantaro getting pissed? 
Pretend that you fainted. Pretend that you died quick. See, these are the um, interactions I'm loving. And people say that I don't want interactions and I complain when I finally get interactions. I don't want pointless interactions. I want interactions like this, like between Genya and um, Seaman. This is uh, Sonami. And then Tanjiro. And then he tells um, Sonami that he ate demons. And now we have this tension between them. Then we have that scene between Obanai and Tanjiro. Because we see that Obanai is really in love with Mitsuni and he's jealous. So he puts him through some hardcore training. And now we're seeing all of this with, with Zenitsu. Like he wants to faint and stuff. Zenitsu's training with Oban um, Sonami. Fuck! With Sonami. Like these are the interactions I love. Fucking Godzilla's coming. Gojira! <laughs> oh my god, he's a demon now. He looks like prayer guy now with his missing eyeballs. Jesus Christ. He's starting to look like a fucking JoJo character. <laughs> my ass. You're all talk. You love your brother. Like, I'd rather Genya be fighting for this. Like, I get Tanjiro's the main character, and he's defending his friends and stuff. But I want, like, Genya to fight back to his brother and have, like, a little emotional scene there, you know? Tanjiro solves everybody's problems. So Tanjiro is... The, the the resolution to to the world's problems like like uh uh muzan the demons the cure cancer everything like i want to i want to again just say this but i like the tantra sticking up for him that's pretty cool we're gonna have sodomy versus tantra or kenya i kind of want brother versus brother bro <laughs> There goes Tanjiro, back to the hospital bed, back in a cast. He stopped his fist and his fucking leg to the neck. Nice. This is awesome. What a good episode, bro. This is really good. I hope nobody comes and stops this. <laughs> Look at these two interacting. He's still defending his brother! Oh my god! Sonami is a fucking unit, bro. Oh, I want to see them fight. Oh my god. Like, come to a resolution together, like, from each other. I don't want anybody else to be there. Like, I, I don't want Tanjiro to be there. I want the brothers to settle this between each other themselves. I'd die for that, bro. That would be great. Wow, you foldable. Calm the fuck down, you foldable, with that waterfall. God damn it. Oh, this is where we're going to go to Kyomi? Yeah, there we go. Music on. We got Connie and Inosuke training together. Oh, shit. Oh, fuck yeah. Let's go, baby. <laughs> Let's see, is there an ending scene? The strongest of the Demon Slayer corpse. What the fuck does that mean? Is that going to be, um, what's his name? Um, I just said his name. Gyomi? Is that going to be him? I think that's his name, right? Oh my God, that's going to be sick. That's going to be sick. I'm ready for that, man. But, um, yeah, okay, so... I think my criticisms of the earlier episodes this season is that it revolved around characters that I've seen already, right? And what I anticipated for the season was to spend time around the characters, the Hashira, that we haven't really spent time with. Like Yomi, Igoro, Sanami, um, who else? E even um, Tomioka, you know what I mean? We had Tomioka's episode. But um, like I don't really care about Tengen anymore. I know there's a, everybody loves Tengen. Like I know that, but like it's cool to see him retired and shit. But like that episode was just fucking boring to me. Like it was just Tanjiro running. Um, I'm just gonna say it, it was boring. I hate saying things are boring, but I didn't like that episode at all. And that's the episode I caught a lot of fucking shit for because I was just being honest with you guys. And then um, the Tokido thing was pretty good too. I think just the first two episodes were really meh to me. And I know there was a lot of interactions, but not the kind of interactions that I really cared too much for. But these past three episodes have been awesome, man. We're seeing these new characters, and I want to see how they interact with, like, Tanjiro and Zenitsu. And now we're going to see Inosuke and Gyomi next week. That's going to be awesome. And it looks like we're wrapping the training up a bit. I feel like the season's coming to, a, to an end. I think it has, like, eight episodes. So I think that's the last Hashira we're training with. And then that's it. But it's cool that we're spending an episode on each Hashira, even though this was on two of them. But um, yeah, man, uh, let me know what y'all thought about the episode. Sayonara.